dad much rather my friend come to me and speak to me and cry on my shoulder than me have to cry when I'm carrying his coffin a week later. You made that passionate, emotional speech about your friend. But earlier in the week as well, you'd said that you'd been fat shamed as well. Obviously, body image is wrapped up. I get fat shamed all the time, lad. <laughs> <laughs> me both. <laughs> Obviously, body image is wrapped up in all mental health issues as well. So my question is, why doesn't men's mental health get taken seriously? It just... <laughs> I've just probably done with you then. Yeah, you did. Sorry, just doesn't, lad. It's crazy. You know, as I said, women talk to each other. They, there's no stigma on women. They sit around and have a cup of tea and have a jangle. True that. Yeah. Men, men <laughs> don't, lad. Men feel like, oh, I can't go and say that to him because he'll think I'm a little, little mushroom. You know what I mean? That's what men think. But as I said in the cage, I'd much rather my friend come to me and speak to me and cry on my shoulder than me have to cry when I'm carrying his coffin a week later. You know what I mean? Split second decisions ruin lives and that's what happened this week and I just don't know how Ricky's mum and sister are getting through this lad because as I say he was my friend but he wasn't my son or my brother and it's going to affect them a lot more than it affects me but as I say people in the position where I'm in people who have got a bit of spotlight who've got a, people, a bit of a following they should help people you know what I mean anyone who's in a position like me you should try and help someone whether it's Joe on the street or whether it's your mate, you know what I mean? You should, you should try and help. We should have to give back because people, without all them fans, without all the people that adore us, we wouldn't get paid what we get paid. We wouldn't have the following that we have. So I just like giving back. And as I said last time, I'm starting a charity for little kids, the little baddies, but I'm also obviously now thinking about doing a men's mental health charity because the UK doesn't give any funding for it. There's no funding for men's mental health and it's the biggest killer but for men between like 21 and 45. And no one talks about it. No one even mentions it, lad. Men just kill themselves and no one cares. We need to change it. It's, you do when you're gonna change it, lad. You can so. do anything you want, lad. You told me that. Obviously, as I said, I wanted to finish him in the first round, lad. So I was p pretty disappointed in between rounds, standing there talking to Ellis and Paul, like, what? I should have this in the bag by now. What's going on here? But I went into this fight with a lot of emotion, a lot of other things on my mind. You know what I mean? So, like, as I say, in the cage after it, I was very critical of my own performance. But Paul spoke to me in the back and just said, what are you doing? You had a lot of other things on your mind going into the fight. And I think you could see that when I come out. I've never come out and threw big shots like that immediately when I've walked out. I'm normally cool, calm and calculated, but I come out and try to take his head off straight away because I... As Can I say, we all... Like, no one, knows the, no one knows the reality of what's gone on, but Paddy's made a real close connection with baby Lee, a four-year-old who had a brain tumor who passed away a couple of weeks ago, and we went to the funeral and laid, paid our respects, and then... Friday morning, 3 a.m., he's had a message saying one of his best mates has killed themselves. Could you imagine being Patrick Pimblett coming out to this reception and having to deliver when you're dealing with that heavy on your heart? So when he's gave that message in front of all of you and he's being honest and he's told you everything about mental health, please believe me. He shows us all that he's iron. He's, he's, no one can break this boy, and I generally believe it. No one can, pe can penetrate that or can penetrate that. But he showed you no matter what, two deaths in two weeks, he can overcome anything.